ahead of the grand final. How's the feeling in the group at the moment? Really excited, to be honest. Um, we obviously had a really tough game on Wednesday night, and the girls have recovered really well, and we've arrived in the party and really looking forward to the challenge against the Pops in the final. Do you feel like you're carrying all that emotion, and it was a pretty electric atmosphere, atmosphere there for you. you? Feel like you're carrying that on? No, I think um, it's just business time now. Um, it was it was fantastic to have this down home, but we need to come together as a group now that we're away from home and away from our, um, you know, our stadium and the noise back there and just come together tight as a group and really perform tomorrow night and have each other's backs. And for you, it was your final game on your home court and now your final game. Uh, how's that going for you? Oh, I, I have not been trying to think about it too much. Obviously, there's you know been a wee bit of hype around it, especially being at home on Wednesday. But for me, um, I really just want to focus on the job and perform well for the team and lead from the front and do everything I can to get that title tomorrow. And you're still, as a whole, obviously defending champions, but I guess just talk about your season because it hasn't been easy from the outset, has it? Yeah, we've certainly been a wee bit inconsistent this year and um, more towards the start of the season and kind of the second half of the season I think we've improved from that in inconsistency. But um, Wednesday night, pretty happy with that performance. Obviously, it was pretty tough, um, pretty tough go game and a big grind, but um, yeah, we really feel like we've been tracking well and um, setting ourselves up nicely for a good encounter tomorrow night. And you'll know the steel pretty well, obviously. So, uh, what are the the main challenges that they bring to the table? The Pulse are certainly a tough side. They um, they're strong throughout the whole court. They've got a lot of young players coming through. Have performed really well in the Pulse dress, and obviously some good leadership following sort of in that circle. So, um, and Amelia Rand's had some really good form too. So, yeah, they're going to be um, they're going to be a tough battle tomorrow night. And I think obviously they're the informed team and the favourites for the game. So, a bit of a swap around from last year, and um, yeah, it's going to be exciting. As a group, and especially down the back end of the season looks like you're all having fun out there and you've got you know a couple of really talented young players as well yeah we all have fun we're um it's a great bunch of girls um i'm certainly going to miss the banter and the fun that we have on tour and um you know being being away with the girls but um yeah we work extremely hard and the girls have been really focused this season and just trying to improve week in week out and um, obviously, yeah, it's just been a great year and lots of fun. Awesome, and obviously people talk about the, the Pulse and the Steel in terms of their attacking game, so it's going to be um, quite the encounter, isn't it? It's going to be a huge encounter for I mean, both teams are going to put everything into it and leave nothing um, unsaid at the end of the game, so it's going to be full on, and um, yeah, it's, it's going to be an exciting battle, and, and we're certainly really excited about it.